have to lock your device remotely on the Samsung Galaxy S7. So by default, you should have a remote control already enabled on your phone. If you have uh, switched it off already, then you need to go into settings and turn it back on. So from the home screen, tap on apps, go into settings. And in settings, go to lock screen and security. Then tap on find my mobile. You need to sign in with your account. So this is the account that you uh, set up once you sign into the Samsung account. Then here is remote control, it is enabled already. So there's nothing you have to do. So it should be enabled by default. Now you need an internet connection, either use a computer, an Android device or some sort of device that you can connect to the internet. Once you connect to the internet, you need to go to findmymobile.samsung.com. So go there and again, you need to sign in with the same account that is set up on your phone and once you sign in with the username and password you should see on the right hand side here there are some options and one of the options is, is to lock my device so tap on that and here you can lock the screen with a pin so tap on lock or you can lock power off so prevent shutting down prevent shutting down the power and network connections to maintain remote control of the device so you can do that also so uh, you can tap on that and you can see here once you do that you can uh, can prevent the shutdown and uh, disconnect the network connections so we're just going to close that and we tap on the lock button and here we need to put in the pin number so I'm just going to put in the pin number first one so I'll just do it again I put in one two three four as an example and you can put in the phone number this is optional so I just uh, put in some random numbers so if it is lost they can call this number and this is the message you can change uh, the message if you wanted to and tap on lock so on the device it should start to lock the device shortly enough so here you can see it shows the phone is locked and the owner's number is the phone number that you have set and now they cannot uh, remove the connections or you cannot uh, shut down the phone so if I try to shut down the phone see what happened so it's so able to power off the device and that's it that's how you can uh, remotely control the device and lock the device so that it doesn't get shut down and by doing it this way you, you can easily locate where is the device is is thank you for watching this video